tied his last time through, and they've got to do something to get this guy out of the role that he's been on. And a check swing here, but he clearly went around on a pitch that would have been a strike anyway. It's nothing in one. And a fastball there is inside as that one backed him up a bit. And that swung on and fouled straight back. The one two. And he will keep it going on the mound. He struck out the side last time through. Now the streak hits four in a row. One away. Number 35. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing and one. Yeah, and it seems like he kind of got away from that pitch here in the last few innings. You got to think about bringing that one right back. Swing and a miss, and it's a ball and two strikes here. We're already at four. <laughs> Do I hear five strikeouts in a row? And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. And this is strike three call. Make it five straight punch outs. Two away now. strike to begin the at bat it's 0 and 1 well on his way to another good inning right here and you see the pitch count it's not even close to being a factor just yet oh it looked like he was towing an anchor there one and two seems like it's been a fairly consistent pattern hard stuff early soft stuff late but these guys don't seem to have caught on yet I'll hold that thought as the play is made out there for round number three and the side is retired Phil Garner will stand in to lead things off in the bottom of the fifth. Swing and a line drive, but foul. Now here's the pitch. And this is going to be a foul ball. Here's the pitch. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. Now another 0-2. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. And that'll get down for what should be extra bases. Oh, and he can't come up with it. Tennis will step in. An RBI single this last time around. Here's the first pitch to him. Now he runs up and gets this one down. And safe, says the first base umpire, as the throw was too late. Jim Holt will try and keep it going. Three for three thus far. Now the first pitch. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. First and second here with nobody out. He waits. Now the pitch. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. And this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. So a three-run shot to left center as they just continue to pour it on here. Number 16 will come in and pitch now. Bert Campanella will be the first one to greet him as he'll start fresh here with the bases empty following the home run. Now he runs up to Bunt, and with his speed, this is going to be tough. But the throw will beat him at first, so the bunt for hit attempt is snuffed out. Right-hander starts to loosen out from the bullpen now. First offering on the way. And this is fouled back and out of play. Pitch on the way. On he's able to go with a fastball as this is sliced into right for a base hit. Reggie Jackson will try again. Two for four in the ball game. Here's the first offering. Foul back. Box. Now the pitch. Runner goes. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw way late, and he's in there easily at second. Three runs already home here. 
He's ready. Now the pitch. Swing and a little tapper out in front of the mound. In time to first, and there are two away. Claude Washington will dig in. He singled his last time around. Washington. Now the first pitch. A fastball here, and this is softly hit and fouled off to the left. He's set. Now the pitch. Now he runs up and gets this one down. Throw to first in time, and you got to question that decision as this side is retired. Number 40 will dig in. 0 for 1 in the ballgame. And that one's in on the hands to start the inning. It's ball one. One thing you can say with certainty, he's really tried to take some ownage on that inside part of the plate. It's something that you need to learn as a young pitcher. You've got to have that willingness to work inside, or guys at this level will just lean out over the plate and eat you up. And this one's down the middle, a ball and a strike. That's in there on the outer half, one and two now. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed, and for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Number 11. Step in. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Now here's the first pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Rudy is over now and he's got it for route number 2. Number 14 will dig in. 0 for 1 here in this one. And a high strike there, 0 and 1. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll toss this one on to first as they're kept off the scoreboard again, and the inning is over. Sal Baco will stand in to start things for Oakland in their half of the six. First pitch of the inning here is wrapped right back from where it came, and that'll get into center field for a leadoff single. Billy Williams will step in. One for four in the ballgame. First pitch coming. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground towards short. And a backhanded try into the hole at short, but this gets on by. And now third base coach Mike Gallego is going to windmill him on home. And the runner will score from first. Phil Garner will step in. He doubled and later scored his last time. Now here's the first pitch. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. A runner at second, nobody out. From the belt, the pitch. And boy, this at bat is not starting off well as he's behind 0 and 2 now. And it's not a whole lot of conviction in that swing. It was almost like an afterthought, like an emergency hat. Hit hard on the ground is short. Throw not in time, and he's in there with his third hit of the afternoon. Gene Tennis. A step in looking to remain perfect. He's already four for four. First pitch to him. Runs up to Bunn and he gets it down to the right side. And the throw will come to first so the sacrifice works as planned. You might have thought for a split second there that he was going to go after the lead runner over at third base. But instead he stops and decides not to risk it and takes that sure out at first. Now here's a fastball up that he sends in the air out to fairly deep center field. Catch is made. Here comes the runner from third. And he will score on the sacrifice fly. Good work there to pick up that second run of the inning. He just gets the ball airborne and it's plenty deep enough to pick up the RBI. First pitch coming. Runs up to Bunn and he gets it down to the right side. And he'll be thrown out at first. So that didn't go quite according to plan. And with it, the inning is over. Number five will dig in now, just hoping to put one in play.